Talk to me about voter demographics because against all the positioning of Donald Trump, he's absolutely cut into the minority vote that the Democrats would have long believed that they owned. Black Americans, Latino Americans. Uh, it's very interesting. We know we've talked about the Cuban Americans in Florida as well. This has been a real feature of the campaign. This has been, I think, a shock to many on the left. It certainly shocked many of the political pundits and the Democrats. These are votes they've just taken for granted. And I think a lot of people in those communities have started questioning why they just blindly support one side, even if it's not in their best interest. So we've seen a massive increase in the Hispanic vote, both, both male and female for Trump. It really did help him secure Florida, Texas, and uh, you see some of the Spouse. counties in Texas. One in particular is a part of county, the most Hispanic uh, part county in, in America. And Hillary Clinton, just four years ago, won it with close to 70% of the vote. This uh, Two days ago, Trump won it. So it's just it's astonishing that he could make up that sort of ground in such a short period of time. Again, there's been an increase in, in the black vote for Trump, both male and female, but more strongly amongst men. Jewish voters also have uh, backed him in bigger numbers than they have in the past. And even members of the LGBT community, which has triggered some of the writers of the New York Times that I read today, they were very upset <laughs> and trying to <laughs> explain how could this, this could possibly happen. But it's not surprising because minorities, just like anybody else, uh, care, care about jobs, care about the economy, that, and, and they've got the same priorities okay, as uh, anybody else does. So why wouldn't they back him? Interestingly, though, according to the exit polls, the one category where he went backwards was white men. Well, older voters, he tends to do better with than young. I expect the Democrats to attract the younger, more progressive uh, crowd, and they have. Um, uh, Catholic voters, I think he got a record number with, with Catholic voters as well um, in this uh, election. Um, we're not still certain of what's going to happen. It's certain that it's probably going to end up in the courts. And Peter, you know, sleep is for the weak. <laughs> Not for me. I